Hello guys, how are you doing? This is Tech Rita here with another video. We will bypass Windows 11's driver PNP stop watchdog code. So let's get started. Type CMD on your search bar, right click the command prompt, and select run as administrator. Type the command below and hit enter. This will prompt the system file checker to scan all system files. SFC scano, wait till the scanning process is over. At this juncture, restart your PC. All corrupt files are replaced. Press the Win key plus R key simultaneously, which will prompt the Run dialog box. Then key in services.msc and press Enter. Locate the VSS in the list, then double-click on it to open its properties window. Set the startup type to automatic and set service status set to running. Then click Apply and OK to save your changes. Now restart your PC. Type CMD in your search bar, right-click the command prompt, then Run as Administrator. Click on Yes when the User Account Control window pops up. Type the following commands one after the other and press enter after each one. Netstop WowServe, Netstop Crypt DSVC, Netstop Bits, Netstop App ID SVC. Press Windows plus ETO open the file explorer, then go to the path below and rename software distribution to software distribution old. See Windows System 32. Also navigate to the path below and rename catroot2 to catroot2 old. See Windows System 32, catroot2. Open the command prompt window once more, then type the following commands and press. Enter after each one. Net start wowserve. Net start crypt svc. Net start bits. Net start mensai server. Net start app id svc. Exit the command prompt. Press the Start menu, type Windows, and select Windows PowerShell Admin to open it. Type the command below and hit Enter. Wacolt Dex slash update. Now press the Win. Locate the recently installed software, right click on it, and hit Uninstall. Restart your system and check if the problem is still persistent. Press the Win key plus I key to open the Windows Settings window. Select Privacy and Security, then select the Windows Security option from the left side. When the window pops up, select Virus and Threat Protection. Select Scan options next to the Quick Scan button. Look for Full Scan, then select Scan Now. Windows Defender will start to scan your PC and provide a detailed report. Press the Win key plus I key to open the Windows Settings window. Select System, then select the Troubleshoot option from the left side. Click the Other Troubleshooter option, locate the Windows Update in the list on the right, and click the Run option. Thanks for watching. If it helps, make sure to hit like and subscribe.